नाम प्रवीण टू फाइव नोन एज प्रोफीन सो टू ऑल दाइज दे स्पीकिंग ऑफ हेरिटेज वे आर यू फ्रॉम Born and bred is where you spend most of your days. Chill it out, Max. <laughs> Hi guys, and welcome back to another video. It's Heritage Month. It's spring in Durban, South Africa, and today we're going back to our roots, our heritage. We at the Bangladesh market, and that's not in. near india it's in chatswood <laughs> yeah former chatswood boy from the fives i was born and grew up a little bit in chatswood and then moved to shalcross but my first job was in chatswood we were married in chatswood yep and yeah our roots are very much still here we still have family so in keeping with our market theme that we've been doing this month we decided to share heritage place with you that is the bangladesh market why it's called that i don't know i just have memories of waking up very early on a saturday morning and being very miserable in this place <laughs> so <laughs> it is an early morning market fresh produce uh snacks and we'll get to see what it's like it's not it's not a flea market yes putting that out there and it's not exactly is it a tourist attraction you would see a lot of chats with uh local social media people put this up but um yeah it has something to do with our heritage so for those of you that don't know what heritage month is i will put it at the bottom basically south africa is a very diverse country with people with all types of backgrounds and we just sharing a piece of ours we're third generation indian south african our great grandparents were from india originally yep so proudly indian south african let's show you chatswood bangladesh market and we have a visitor <laughs> always popping up you know what are you doing here today i'm going to shop for vegetables <laughs> do you have any memories of this market yes lots of memories mm. with my parents speak about the one you spoke about earlier what you remember the most <laughs> when you enter <laughs> they were is advertising for carrier packets <laughs> and say it like how they used to say <laughs> carrier packets <laughs> okay they don't do that anymore but she's right let's check out the markets in westcliff what's known as unit 3 when you see this big church you know you've arrived at the market oh we're in the parking lot see you at the market
morning. Fresh chicken on sale. Fresh produce. Fresh fruits and veggies. We are one of the vendors here, yeah? selling his uh, fresh bananas, yeah? ripe bananas. So if you're in the market, come and see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. So if you have the Bangladesh market, you can check out uh, Stanley's Seafoods, uh, one of the old time uh, fishery guys. So, yep, that's his details up there. If you have the market, just check out Stanley, yeah? He's with your fresh fish and uh, seafood and a whole lot of, yeah. Good on yourself? Oh, nice. And then I also do tours to India. I also do my tours to India. Wow. I'm a tour leader. Wow, check this out. And it's all group tours? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So this is like senior this citizens is and all of that, yes. they all. I've got okay. one for December and then I also got a 12 days uh, March. Oh, lovely. Nice. So, guys, if you're looking for a trip, a group tour trip, check it out. The person to see here, Mr. Segi Governor, and that's his details. He does tour trips for senior citizens and whoever else wants to tour. I also do Mauritius, uh, Bangkok, Singapore, Malaysia. Oh, lovely. Nice. <laughs> so if you need all your gardening stuff, it's all here at the market. How's it? What's the price of all your, your pot plants at all? How is it? How's it, man? How are you? Okay. What's the price of your pot plants? I got them like for 35, 40, 45. They flower like throughout the year. Not seasonal, not three months, six months. Okay. Oh, nice. I got roses on special as well. How much are they? Oh, nice.
Oh, yeah. Strange with mango and banana is crazy than the packet. Oh, yeah. And then you have the jackfruit here, which is uh, tender. Oh, yeah. Give me one of that. So I actually got some uh, chili bite to taste. Say that again. I sell the most divine fish cakes. They come with a money back guarantee. Anytime. So uh, you can be rest assured the taste is there. Three of that please. So it once tasted never wasted. What's the difference between these Alright, so this is a plain bulgur, this is a pumpkin fritter and this is a urinda. The wooden is the one of the darling. <laughs> she likes all of them. I love the wooden. It's not confusing. Her. Let her finish mine first. So this is us in our car boot. It looks like, by judging by what we have, we spent a small fortune, but we actually didn't. I don't know what I'm eating. It's a samosa. I know it's a samosa, but I don't know what the filling is like. But let's check it out. Hmm. It's tin fish. That's my favorite. Ooh. Is it good? Oh, I'm trying a chicken tikka pie. Okay. See, it's like a samosa pastry. Yeah, Does it? A chicken yeah. tikka samosa. A chicken tikka samosa. Yeah. So, potato, banana. <laughs> tasty, tasty. Really? I can't feel you, but I like. I like the. The question is, who's tasting the jackfruit? I like the better than. Wow. I really don't like jackfruit, but. Mixed up. But it doesn't stop. Banana. Taste it. Idli. South Indian delicacy. Bring it, bring it. No more back. No back. Chuckle fermented bread. So guys, this is a jackfruit. And one more. This is something we don't eat often. It's actually oh, a at all, actually. It's battered, so that's what it looks like. Mm. Is it? Yep. Ah. I think we need to get another opinion. Well, I I like Jackson, so... I don't think I've ever had a better I, I... I've tasted Jackson before. And? Yeah. It's not bad at all. I don't know it. what it tastes like. But oh, I normally have the uh, like sliced up, so. but it. not fried. Not you fried. had it fried. Okay. You make curry. Or? Yep. The best fish cakes ever, apparently. Mm. Oh my God! It really is good. This is delicious. Definitely. Uh, Go to you. Washing everything down. Tasty as ever. No, I love Wurundas. Oh, this is a very full Wurunda. Yeah. More filling than better. Yeah. This looks um. It's not like crushed like. I got it. So this is what we got from the market today. We could not taste everything. Those are roti rolls. Let's open one. It is a roti roll. So join us for a quick picnic at home. Mm. Mm. Nice. So what are we eating first? For me, it's going to be the gulgula. I think for three weeks in a row I've been eating this in different markets. We brought it home. Mm. You can taste the spices in this one. 
This is a pumpkin fritter. Mm, I can't really get a pumpkin taste. Take another bite. Mm. So what does it taste like? It tastes like a fritter. A fritter? I'm enjoying this uh, chicken and chips uh, roti roll. Definitely for me, we ate this fresh at the oh, that was nice. at the market, the fish cake. The lady was not exaggerating. This is really good. It's made with fresh ingredients. As you can see, all the greens are... Wow. I am definitely going to be back at Bangladesh market for these fish cakes. She said money back guaranteed and I can see why. And the Bombay crash, but I, I seem to love that everywhere we go. So guys, this is the jackfruit we're talking about. That's after eating a bit of it. But this is massive. Mm -hmm. And you can eat everything, yeah? Uh, what are you eating for? I don't know. I, I know it has a very strange fruit. No, this is a brinjal. Enough. Battered brinjal. Tasty. And? <laughs> it's a very silent <laughs> tasting. It's called a silent tasting. It's so strange. I don't like the feeling in my mouth. But I think I'm getting in my own head. Because I know it's it's durian jackfruit, so your favorite fish cake. So three of us, fish cake number one. And we're back with more snacks. Do you wanna eat a snowball? <laughs> okay, bye. Homemade. 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 Mm. Made oh, by an auntie. Oh, this is nice. Mm. Good way to end. Can I change my uh, view? Yeah. No, I like this. Oh, this you can nice. have this piece. You too. Mm, it's really tasty. Mm. Oh. It's five rand. Five rand each. Seriously, the prices at Bangladesh are... Delicious. The prices at Bangladesh are really, really yeah, well worth. You, you want a piece? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> it's cool. You know what? I only bought two because I didn't think. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. So, guys, it's been quite an uh, adventurous uh, day. We came pretty early in the morning, and now the market is really busy. So, overall, the uh, the vibes are actually, as I remembered it from like maybe decades ago as well too yep it's still the same the fresh produce is like like really really good the uh, snacks were actually very delicious definitely uh, you get bang for your buck here yeah i think just coming out with like a full packet of things yeah you're not, not gonna cost you an arm and a leg, yeah but. i think in total we spent less than 200 rand on everything that we bought um, yeah, Bangladesh market needs no introduction. People come from all over the place. It even features in one of my favorite local movies, Keeping Up with the Kandasamis. So if you want to check it out in a movie setting, check out that movie. Yeah, so until the next one, and keep watch for next week. Happy Heritage Month to everyone. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.